Do you experience several of these things? Skin and eyes that appear yellowish. Abdominal pain and swelling. Swelling in the legs and ankles. Itchy skin. Dark urine color. Pale stool color. Chronic fatigue. Nausea or vomiting. Loss of appetite. Tendency to bruise easily. If you have several of these, you may have a problem with your liver. The liver is a large, meaty organ that sits on the right side of the belly. Weighing about 3 pounds, the liver is reddish-brown in color and feels rubbery to the touch. Normally you can't feel the liver because it's protected by the rib cage. The liver has two large sections, called the right and the left lobes. All the blood leaving the stomach and intestines passes through the liver. The liver processes this blood and breaks down, balances, and creates the nutrients and metabolizes drugs into forms that are easier to use for the rest of the body or that are non-toxic. There are many kinds of liver diseases, diseases caused by viruses, such as hepatitis A, hepatitis B, and hepatitis C. Diseases caused by drugs, poisons, or too much alcohol. Examples include fatty liver disease and psoriasis. Over time, Conditions that damage the liver can lead to scarring, psoriasis, which can lead to liver failure, a life-threatening condition. But early treatment may give the liver time to heal. The following are symptoms associated with liver diseases. Skin and eyes that appear yellowish, jaundice. It's a disease that turns your skin and the whites of your eyes yellow. Newborn babies often get it. But adults can too. See a doctor right away if you think you have jaundice. This could be a symptom of a liver problem. Jaundice happens when there's too much bilirubin, a yellow-orange substance, in your blood. It's found in your red blood cells. When those cells die, the liver filters it from the bloodstream. But if something's wrong and your liver can't keep up, bilirubin builds up and can cause your skin to look yellow. Jaundice is rare in adults, but you can get it for many reasons which includes hepatitis, alcohol-related liver disease, blocked bile ducts, pancreatic cancer, and certain medicines. Abdominal pain and swelling. The sites is fluid buildup in the belly, abdominal, cavity caused by fluid leaks from the surface of the liver and intestine. The sites from liver disease often occurs with other liver disease symptoms, such as portal hypertension. Symptoms of ascites may include a swollen belly. Swelling in the legs and ankles. Liver disease can cause foot and ankle swelling due to the liver not functioning properly. This leads to excess fluid in your legs and feet, which causes swelling. Liver disease can be caused by genetic factors. Viruses, alcohol, and obesity are also linked to liver damage. Itchy skin. If you have liver disease, you might have higher levels of bile salt accumulating under the skin, which may cause itching. Not everyone with high levels of bile salts feels itchy, and some people feel itchy despite a normal bile salt level. Histamine. Some people with pruritus have raised histamine levels. Dark urine color. Several liver conditions can lead to brown urine. Hepatitis refers to inflammation of the liver, usually from a viral infection. This can cause urine to become darker and appear brown. Antiviral medications are the primary treatment for some types of viral hepatitis. Pale stool color. Bile salts are released into your stools by your liver, giving the stools a brown color. If your liver is not producing enough bile, or if the flow of the bile is blocked and not draining from your liver, your stools may become pale or clay-colored. Having pale stools occasionally may not be a cause for concern. Chronic fatigue 
Fatigue is a symptom commonly described by people with liver disease, hepatitis. Regardless of whether the hepatitis is caused by a virus, excess alcohol or fat consumption, or an inherited disease. The associated fatigue may be intermittent or constant, mild, or debilitating. Nausea or vomiting. Nausea and upset stomach are common early symptoms of liver disease, but as your liver's ability to eliminate toxins decreases, your digestive distress will likely increase. Ongoing nausea is a reaction to excess waste products in the body, and unexplained vomiting is often linked to liver problems. Loss of appetite because the liver plays a key role in the digestive system, psoriasis and cancer in the liver can both cause you to lose your appetite and you may lose weight. Chemotherapy, radiation therapy and other cancer treatments can also have an impact, especially if you experience side effects such as nausea and vomiting, mouth ulcers, and taste and smell changes. Tendency to bruise easily. As liver disease progresses, the liver may stop producing the proteins that help the blood clot. As a result, a person may experience excessive bleeding and easy bruising. They may also become very itchy, feel very tired or sick, and have swollen legs, dark urine, and yellowing eyes or skin. When to see a doctor. If you have any persistent signs or symptoms that concern you, schedule an appointment with your doctor. If your abdomen discomfort is so terrible that you can't sit still, seek medical help right once. Never ignore or underestimate these things when you feel you are experiencing several of them.